Hi friends and Israel fans, come and join me in another episode of Israel with Moshe. An interesting fact is that this place in the Bible is called Caesarea Philippi, but on the maps you're not, you're not going to find the name Caesarea Philippi, you're going to find the name Banias. And Banias comes from the Roman name of the place. In Roman times this city was called Paneas or Pameas, named after the god Pan, the same god of nature and running water. And when it was taken by the Muslims, Muslims cannot pronounce the letter P, it sounds like a B, and so from pa Panias it became Banias. But this was the major city during Crusader period that protected one of the main water sources of the Jordan River, the River Banias, and also protected the road coming from Damascus because right above us to the north is the road to Damascus. The big rock behind me and the cave, this is the cave where the river Banyas begins from. In that big hall, there was a main temple for the god of Hell, the god of Hades. So ancient people used to believe that this is the gates of Hades. And around here is this whole pagan area with the temples of Augustus, the temple of Pan and other temples. And as I said before, no reason for Jews to come here. And yet, Jesus brings the disciples all the way from the Sea of Galilee here, Matthew 16. Jesus makes the disciples walk through swamp land and climb and all the way that they're coming here they're probably thinking what are we doing here why are we coming here this is an area that Jews usually don't visit and then Jesus brings them here and here he chooses to ask them the following question who do men say that I am and then they start saying some say you're Jeremiah some say you're Elijah some say you're a prophet and he says but you who do you say that I am and of course this is the place where Peter comes with the answer, you are the Christ, the son of the living God. First time that somebody um, declared or announced that Jesus is Christ. And Jesus looks at Peter and says, this is a prophecy, Peter. You, it didn't come, it didn't come from you. It came from, your, from my, my father in heaven. And then he points to this big rock and he says, um, your name is Peter. Your name shall be Petrus, which means a rock. And upon this big rock, this big Petra, I will build my church and yours are the keys to the kingdom of heaven. And this is actually the first time that somebody recognized the fact that Jesus is Christ. 